Squat lobsters are small crustaceans. More than 1,000 species are known and classified into two large superfamilies. They come in a range of colors and can be very abundant in the areas that they occupy, especially in the deep sea. They live from coral reefs to extreme habitats like hydrothermal vents and cold seeps. Although they look like lobsters, they are more closely related to hermit crabs. The abdomen, or tail, is tucked underneath the squat lobster's body. They have only three visible pairs of legs, aside from their claws. There is a small fourth pair of legs tucked out of sight. They have long whip-like antennae that they use like cat whiskers to locate objects. They are mainly active after dark. Deep water species tend to inhabit sand or mud substrates. Many shallow water species live in rocky or algae covered areas. They range in size from a few tenths of an inch to about four inches. These crustaceans can move fast. Many are commensal meaning they can live closely with other organisms without harming them. For example, some live inside sponges, others hang out on coral or feather stars. Most remain on the seafloor, but some swim up the water column at night to feed and return to the seafloor during the day. They flap the abdomen to swim. A squat lobster's claws can be more than twice as long as its body. They use the claws to catch big prey. Many species have hairy bodies. They use the hairs to catch small prey. They may be suspension feeders, deposit feeders, grazers, scavengers, or predators. Most are scavengers, eating anything that floats by or settles on the ocean floor. Some feed on small crustaceans or cephalopods in the water column. Squat lobsters lay eggs that hatch into free-swimming larvae. Larvae feed on plankton. Some species are commercially important and sold as food for humans. Many fish prey on squat lobsters. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.